We are back in Mechanica, the game where we build our own automated bases and we are about to be under attack. This is not ideal, but we have our power. Power of flame! Burn fiends! Oh, they're gonna die so hard. It's actually not a bad combo at all. Oh, they're so dead, dude. I just hope that this doesn't destroy resources they drop. Oh my god, it's so good. Because the guns keep pushing them back. They just walk straight into my flames. I love it. I love this game. Oh, oh they okay. We are actually Gucci. Wow. All right. That's so much better than last time. Yeah, I really, really enjoyed this game. It's literally my jam. And I'm gonna keep on playing it. Because I, I just wanna. It's actually playing this immediately after the last video. Because I just, you know, I couldn't not play it. I couldn't. I Usually I would wait for like, uh, close the video and see people actually like it. But this game is so good. I can't, I can't wait. I, I gotta play more. Hello, dear sir. You dare mess with me? Oh, you're gonna get blown to bits, my dude. You're gonna get so blown to bits, you have no idea. Hello, sir. Yes, come over here. Come this way, you know. I have something to show you. I have a button here. Look at this. Look at my button. Oh, he is so dead. He didn't even know what was coming for him. Hello, sir. Come here. Come to, come to Papa. Oh, they just keep on coming, but they keep on falling apart. Oh, it's so good. It's okay, I can just chill here, you know? Thanks to the flames, a nice cozy fire. <laughs> I love it. Oh, sweet, sweet vengeance. I love it so much. What is my plan for today? To kill more robots, of course. That's very important. I also have a fairly good defense system. I'm fairly happy with it. What I actually want to do is I want to build my own base. I don't want to live in the in this in this area. I want to build my own building with walls and like a corridor of traps and doom and despair. Walls, fairly expensive, ten steel each. Doorways, fairly expensive. It's mostly steel though, and we can deal with that. See, I see you over there, my dude. I see you. We can deal. We can deal with getting more steel. What I think I actually want to create here is I want to add more miners to our current steel production facility because these metals are very fast, but these things are so painfully slow. So if I have two of them. They can drop things on the same conveyor belt and we can go all we can all go to the same smithing area and smith twice as fast. That is gonna be what I'm gonna try to achieve right now. I'm gonna eh, let's turn this on. I'm not sure if they attract to sound or not. It might be, they might not. I have no idea. We'll figure things as we go. Alright, so I built two extra miners. I'm gonna just recycle this entire thing right now. I know, I know, I know. I'm complicating things. It's okay. Oh okay. I figured we would just get all the stuff from the thing immediately, but I guess it just flies out into the void. Thankfully, it wasn't lost. That's the most important thing. Yeah, well, how much iron do we have in here? A lot. Like, there's still so much of it. But wait, can we, like, chop down the box? Like, we did get an axe. And it did say it's for chopping stuff. Is that a thing we can do? No. What about trees? Because there is a tree over here. I don't think, like, anything has... Oh, we actually can. What do we get from that? Wood. Wooden stuff. I don't think I saw anything that was made out of wood yet. Like, looking at all these recipes. What is made... I'm guessing it's maybe just decoration stuff? Oh, uh, there we go. Crates. Okay, it's just for decoration, it seems. Pallets and crates and wooden tables. And artwork as well. Very, very creepy. Okay, it seems to be, like, most decorative. I'm guessing it eventually it, it might be used for powering stuff up. Not quite sure. But for now, we don't have to worry about that at all. But right, it is gonna work. Let me just check if these are actually gonna drop stuff onto them. Okay, make sure they're all... Okay, they are actually dropping stuff onto them. Awesome. Are they all operational? They, they are. They are. Does that actually, like, give me stuff immediately? Kind of weird when I turn it off. I guess it, the progress is uh, it restarting again, running to mine again. I guess it makes perfect sense. All right, and now we just gotta get, you know, one of these bad boys right here. Be super easy. Where's the output? Drop to ores below. It's not ideal, because it's gonna drop stuff on the opposite side of me, but like this crate is in the way and I can't remove it. I thought I could remove it maybe, but I, I wasn't able to. I guess I could place these on the other side, but you know, it doesn't really matter that much. It's gonna like, take me like maybe half a second more every time to pick things up, so I don't, I really, really don't care about being a tiny bit inefficient. Go. All right, turn it on. It should be working fine. Make sure we actually test it out first before we get things mess messed up. More of these bad boys, and you will be putting stuff directly into the storage box. Beautiful. What's the capacity? It's very large. I don't know what the stack size is. I'm hoping 
We will not reach it anytime soon. It's been this off. You actually do get things back. I guess it's still going up, huh? I guess the, the movement down is what gives us the ore. Alright, so we have a... Ooh, nasty. Hopefully they will not fall out. That would be kind of unfortunate. But yeah, we have a, a lot more things mining. And I just want to see... Is this actually going to be able to keep up with the demand here? I don't think it actually is. I think we will be... Yeah, I think we'll be like smelting things faster than we can mine them. So we can even add one more. But honestly, this is already so, so much better that I really don't care that much. There we go. We tripled our copper output as well. Fairly, fairly easy going, you know. Not much trouble with me doing that. Let's actually get some of this copper we have in inventory in here as well. It's all loaded up. It's all coming in here nicely. Beautiful. So we're going to have a lot of copper, a lot of steel coming along. What I want to do next is, of course, while I wait for these things to come along, I kind of do some exploring on my own, you know? I'm not sure what we can find, but I do know that we can find stuff. I see buildings over there. I see some stuff over there. I want to go see what's actually in that location. Maybe there's some useful loot. Maybe there's actually some turrets we can use for ourselves. Of course, there are robots coming around. They're walking, doing their tours and whatnot. I'm going to try to stay away from them. Oh, it's just my iron, huh? All right, so once we run out of that, the pod's going to have to like, move over here. That's okay. That's fine. No big deal. Maybe they regenerate over time. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what happens when we use all the resources on the map. But I kind of like... I want to move my base. I don't want to be there. I want to drain those resources as soon as possible and move my base somewhere else. This can be good. Are these EMPs? Oh, it's going to be so useful. All right. These are EMPs indeed. What the hell are you? Autocrafter? Dude. Uh, give me stuff. Why would I ever craft stuff on my own? Like, I just find it over here. Oh, God! Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know why you scared me that much. It wasn't that scary, honestly. It's just that I wasn't expecting him to be over here at all. Right, dude. I'm sorry for yelling at you. You can follow me if you want. You know, I'll take you back home and I will show you my uh, fire display. It's totally harmless. You'll, you'll love it. Man, this map is actually so massive. I thought it was the end, but there's like so much more over there. That's amazing. I might take us a long... Oh, there's windmills. Okay, this, like, that map is a lot. I thought it was just a small square. Like I thought that was one corner. I thought like this building was the other one, but it seems to be super open. And there's even a bridge. Oh my gosh. Okay, 2000. These ones are richer. So, okay, that's good. I want to explore the church here. I just want to take a peek at the bridge. I'm gonna try not to get scared like last time. Open the box. Oh, baby. Batteries. Amazing. What's down there? Some more crates. Probably some more loot. I see something over there as well. We'll get there soon, you know. I'm not sure if there are any vehicles in the game. I don't think there are. There is like a like a little spinning disc. Oh, it's a lovely place here. You know, we can move in here. Maybe. I can actually use this to kind of uh, see what's actually going on. There's a button here. I guess this is a light, right? Oh, ho, ho! oh it's a good thing I went through the back engine, my dude. Wow, okay. Hold on. I didn't want to remove that. You give me the rake trap. That would have caused me a hell of a lot of damage. That might have even killed me. I want to check out this shack over here. Oh, I see the ocean. I mean, it's like the, I, there's three of these buildings. There's one, there's... Two, and there's a third one over there. I have a hunch that might be the robot factory. I don't know why. It's just that these robots, they have to come from somewhere, right? Or copper over here. I want to check out that building. I think I'm going to slowly head back. 2000. So it, it is richer than the old ones. Just keeps on going, dude. Oh, it's even bigger over there. That's crazy. This map is so big. I wasn't expect. I thought the maps were like very, very small. But I guess I was totally wrong. Odyssey. I'm trying to scan for things. Is this locked in? I don't think we can actually enter this place at all. Huh. That's weird. So it's... It's just... Completely blocked in. Can we like... Maybe there's a way to enter from the top? I don't know how we would get there. I guess we could like make stairs. Because there is a stair item. No, over here. Buildings. Foundation stairs. It's just for foundations, so it doesn't actually 
I don't know. I mean, I guess we could, like, build a building next to it and climb that way, but... I don't know, dude. Hello, lighthouse. I see no traps. I see no traps. We match some things for good measure. What is... Can we even enter this place? This is not a lot... So it actually can't even enter it. It's so, so spooky, dude. I was... Oh, hello there. Hello there, thing. Need to open the box. A lot of batteries. Okay, so I'm guessing these things always have batteries on them. Very, very useful. Maybe we actually can open the door if we don't have this in the hand. No, it doesn't appear to be openable at all. That's weird. Very, very weird. Is this... Oh, hello, 1000. And hello, 500. So this actually might be a good spot for a mini base. Oh, it's the, it's the map. I see. Cannot fall off, which is good to know. So I'm going in that direction. Okay, okay. Again, this is, the game is very early access. So I'm guessing uh, this is supposed to either be like um, like a sea or something. Probably not. Probably like just an endless desert. Because right now it's just flat ground with nothing on it. Don't fall down, dude. I, almost, I wasn't looking where I was going. Almost fell down. Hey, potatoes. Don't mind if I do. Thank you. So what I think I'm gonna do, I'm gonna go check out that thing over there. Then I'm gonna head under that bridge, because we did, did see some crates. I'm gonna go loot those bad boys. And then I'm gonna go back to our base and, uh, you know, just see how much stuff we got. Because again, I want to start building my own base. I don't want to live in some creepy old gas station. I want to build my own building. We're gonna have, live a long, happy life without any robots. Hello there, pipe. The giant old pipe. Well, it's kind of like a mine shaft, honestly. Like a mining pipe, but there doesn't seem to be anything to help us make it operational. So I'm gonna assume it's nothing right now. Also, we have like those windmills. I definitely want to go check out those sooner or later. But to be perfectly honest, that can wait. I have other things on my mind right now. Hello, Mr. Robot. Please don't mess with me. I'm gonna leave you alone as long as you leave me alone. He's not gonna leave me alone. He's a righteous bastard that just wants to murderize me completely. Here we are. This is the bridge. Make sure there's nothing we can get killed by over here. There's nothing. That's so disappointing. Can we get up into the top one? I bet we can, right? It seems to be empty as well. I was hoping there would be something over here, dude. I saw a cool bridge. I assumed, you know what? That means resources. But in the end, there was nothing. Kind of sad now. All right, let's head back home. Because we are getting kind of low on water. So I know I said I was going to go back home. But I see a shack and I see a sign. And I know I just cannot resist. I gotta see what they're all about. Check for traps. Coming soon, of course. Oh, it's... Oh, I see. Some finished areas. Awesome. That actually makes me very happy. That means there's more cool stuff to come. Can we even enter the shack here? We can. There's nothing in there. Whatever. Let's head home for real now. Home, sweet home. Let's see how much stuff we got in our absence. Does this even work in our absence? It does. Oh, that's a lot of good stuff. That is a lot. We want to leave the storage box in there. You know, it's perfectly fine. Bunch of water as well. We're going to have a ton of steel. Really happy. Just let's do a quick look see around here. Make sure there are no unwanted enemies. Good. Safe. I guess I could, like, leave, live here. But I want to build my own place. I feel like there's something that's... I, I really do want to build my own place. It's going to make me happy. So that's exactly what I'm going to go for. Let's actually leave all these bars in here. Doesn't really matter. What are we doing over here, my dude? Oh, there's so much stuff in here. Love it. Getting through this fairly quickly. It's going to last us for quite a long time, though. No need to worry whatsoever. Plenty of ores, plenty of everything, plenty of... Not that much glass, actually. How much glass do we actually need is what I desire to know. How much glass is needed for these things? Not that much, really. It's only for glass windows. How much glass do we have right now? We have only for one window. You know what? If I build my dream home, I want to have windows. So I'm going to get some more glass extractors. Because they will work automatically, right? There we go. Gonna put more of these bad boys. I mean, I guess you can do stuff on your own. You know, you are making things really easily here. How much is a glass refinery anyways? Do what I want to know. Glass refinery. Where is that? Stored manufacturing? Glass refinery? You know? Easiest thing in the world. Make a small boy. 
Uh, missing copper. Okay, first of all, make a bunch of copper wires. We need copper wires anyways. We can actually automate that now, now that we have the the auto crafter. Oh, it has HP of some kind? No, that's just the the, the marker of the type, I think. Glass refinery, you need a circuit board and some screws. You know, screws are needed always. Circuit board's got a couple of those as well, just in case. Glass refinery, beautiful. BEA, beautiful. You know what? Small screen. No, another one. Another one. We did it, Reddit. Beautiful. Do you have these over here? Kind of askew. So it's not a problem. Turn them all on. Ideally, we have a... Uh, you know what? I Let's not even bother with ideally. Let's just get one of these bad boys over here. Easiest thing in the world. Hopefully, it will not fall off. This should be good. And then, we do have... One of these already made from before. What the hell is this? Laser tripwire. Right, that's the thing I got from the rake trap area. Gotta be careful not to get murderized. I left it in the copper thing, right? Why did I do that? Because I'm a silly dummy? Only possible solution and answer to this question? There we go. Alrighty. Get stored, son. These things take a long time to be crafted. But, you know, they're very simple to craft at the same time, so I'm not too worried about it. Oh, hello, robots. You wanna mess with me? Feel free. Be my guest. Be my flipping guest, dude. I'm gonna get shot in the butt so many times. Hey, come here. No, it's just a fire. Just a little bit of fire. No need to worry about it. Oh, you are so dead now. There's more of you. Oh my god, it's actually awesome. It's free resources, dude. I love it. Hello, sir. Oh, he's fast. He's coming. I don't like him. Why is he alive? Please kill the robots. Thank you. This guy... He seems to be kind of resistant to damage. There we go. Beautiful. Simple. Oh my god, fire! I, I walked into it like a dummy. It's okay. It's okay. Relax. Turn it off. Be calm. Be good. All right, you know what? I'm fairly happy with what we did today. We explored a lot on the map. We got a lot of resources. We automated a lot more things. It's gonna be a lot easier now. And we actually have, like, so many ingots all of a sudden. We can make our base fairly easily, right? How much is the foundation? Foundation is, I think, 50? 25. Beautiful. We can make three foundations. I'm gonna go, like, wait until we get a little bit more steel. Make a bunch of foundations. Make a bunch of walls. Doorways. And make, you know, a little... We do have, like, walls, right? Defensive walls. We do have those as well. I'm gonna make my own base. I'm gonna find a location I like. Kind of probably close to this area. Probably, like, in the middle of that valley over there, right? That makes sense, I think. Like, over there. We can make a base over there. We will have doors, walls, defenses, foundations, everything. And we can even, like, automate conveyor belts to, like, bring everything all the way back to our base. Be totally doable, I think. And, you know. It's awesome. I love it. I absolutely love it. But, yeah, I think I'm gonna actually just end this one here. Robots are gonna keep coming, but we have no problem dealing with them now. We have plenty of weapons, plenty of firepower, literally firepower, my dude. Sir. I do not appreciate your tone, mister. Why are you coming at me with that blade? Can you please die? Thank you. Was that so hard? No. That was actually very, very easy. Yeah, I'm gonna end this one here. Thank you all so much for watching. It's been twisted. I'm Honey Bunny Games. Now we'll see you next time.